Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you about this embryo plastic neuroepithelial tumor, the DNET imaging. Terminology This embryo plastic neuroepithelial tumor can be benignic clear neuronal neoplasm. Adjacent cortical dysplasia is frequently present. Most common sign and symptom partial complex seizure. Imaging may occur in any region of supra-temporal cortex. Major temporal lobe is most common. Type called shabu demarcated, open red shape, open cystic, bubbly, minimal or no mass effect, no very tumor element. Some that have less distinct margin associated. Cortical dysplasia is more in this case. When frontal on stage or ring enhancement in 20 to 30 percent. Classification in 6 to 36 percent. Slow or no growth over the years. Remodel their overlying bone in 20 to 44 percent. This is T2 MI in a 12 years old patient with seizure, so a bubbly microcystic lesion in a right occipital lobe with no significant muscle pain. This bubbly replacement of normal brain parenchyma is the most specific apparent for this embryoplastic neuroepithelial tumor. T2 MI in a 5 years old boy with new onset seizure, so a T2 hyperintense tumor with multiple cystic space that completely replaced and mildly enlarged the left hippocampus. The story, location, and cystic morphology are all typical for DNAs. Non-contrastant MCT in a 10 years old boy with close heteromyl, so an incident collision. The cortical and subcortical hypoattenation in subtle with classification being the most conspicuous finding. Classification do occur in 6 to 36 percent of DNA, which is less common than gangliome. non contrast in NCT in a 16 years old patient with long standing seizure, so a low attenuation, cortical base mass in the right. Partalo. DNET was found at surgery. Clear <laughs> MI in the same patient, so the characteristic apparent of the DNET, the mass is vertically based, sharply demarcated, the web shape with hyperintendry. The tumor po points toward the ventricle and there is no surrounding edema. Treatment. Caesar may become untouchable. Glutamate receptor so within tumor and margin may explain typical record to control seizure. Most important factor for long-term seizure freedom. 
cross total resection of Schumer and Chesson protocol dysplasia. Thank you.